field coming on now for race number 10 featuring win and the place wagering second elimination for three-year-old pacing Philly here's that field one is stormy classic owned by Fred and Judy Scott of Moorhaven Florida Fred Scott trains Bill Alanya will drive to Sarah smile on by the Midwood stable of Brooklyn, New York. Irvin Miller, the trainer, Andy Miller in the bike. Three OG Scarlet, owned by Bobby Dexter, Paducah, Kentucky. Roy Finn trains. Fred Finn Jr. will drive this eight-time winner of this season. Four Fox Valley Allegra, owned by Fox Valley Standard Breads of Sherman. Tony Alanya trains and drives. Five Long Island Lolita, owned by Lloyd Dalton. Nancy Dalton of Kentucky by Harry Copenhaver of Hinsdale. Lloyd Dalton, the trainer, Ken Holiday up. Six Fox Valley Monica, owned by Joe Muscara, Huntington Valley, Pennsylvania. Nelson Willis trains and Dale Heitman drives. Seven Cyber Wave, owned by Stan Miller of Etna Green, Indiana. He trains Sam Widger drives. And number eight, Rose.com, owned by John Leahy, Anderson Racing, Inc., and Tom Lewandowski of Illinois and Indiana. Joe Anderson, the trainer, Ryan Anderson in the bike. That's the field for the second elimination. Five more to qualify for the final. Gate picking up speed. Here they come. They're often pacing from the far outside. Rose.com burst from the gate between horses out quickly. Long Island Lolita inside her out quickly. Two is OG Starlet. And on the inside, Stormy Classic as that field powers into the first turn. They're racing toward the quarter. Stormy Classic is shuffled back now to be fifth. And on the outside, up to take command, to lead it now by a neck, a length, a length and a half, is Long Island Lolita. Along the inside, settles second as they drive to the quarter is Sarah Smile. She got it well for Andy Miller. Racing behind her third, dropped in there, is OG Starlet. Fourth behind her as they race past the uh, quarter mile mark is Fox Valley Monica. On the outside, racing fifth, hunting cover, not finding it, parked. Rose.com inside her next down the backside is Stormy Classic 6 and 7 on the outside underway now is Cyber Wave as they race toward the half mile mark. Trending the field, Fox Valley Allegra and on the outside making her way toward the front comes Cyber Wave off a 26 and 3 front quarter. So the front quarter quickly uh, paced as they race now to the half mile mark by the leader and the leader now as they race past the half is Long Island Lolita. On the outside, ranging up comes Rose.com. She's been aired all the way. Third inside her, Sarah Smile. Fourth on the outside comes Cyberwave. On the inside of her, OG Starlet is next. As they're at the half and 57 seconds, a breather second quarter. They're approaching now the three-quarter mile mark. The leader is Long Island, was Long Island Lodita, still is past three quarters. And on the outside, tipped out three wide, racing past Phillies comes Cyberwave. They're at the top of the lane. Fox Valley Allegra has pace. She'll come three deep as they turn for home. And the final going on the inside, Long Island Lolita on the outside, Cyberwave trying. Here comes OG Starlet getting shook loose. And on the inside, Sarah Smile. Those four, they drive to the wire. The leader, Long Island Lolita, Cyberwave at her. And a photo for third at the wire is going to be Cyberwave. Home second, Long Island Lolita, photo for three, OG Starlet and Sarah Smile. Final check, final qualifier was Fox Valley Monica. Fox Valley Allegra was six, Stormy Classic seven, in 152, four fifths. One. The Cole Muffler filly from Hey You by Noble and Sam. Picks up her fifth win, 152, four fifths in this one. Ken Holiday behind that winning filly. As he has been in her previous starts at Balmoral. And there she is, 52 and 4, winner of her elimination of the three year old filly race for Pacers. So that sets up the race off here next week between this great filly and Determination Plus. And there she is, Lloyd Dalton and Harry Copenhaver's Long Island Lolita.